Okay. Second episode for the night. And I was losing my mind. So, let's get back to it. Because this guy, forget who he is. Like, he's, he's one of the seamen. Right? Right, he's one of the seamen. He's got that kind of outfit. Right. Right, I'm going to mark him down as an unknown seaman for now. Which leaves quite a few options here. But... I, I'm kind of pissed off because I can't find his body. This is where he died and I cannot tell you. Let me... Let me take one last look at this. Let me, since it's like right here, we don't have to do anything special. You know what? I think he was picked up by the beast. I think he was crushed by the beast. Or drown. What I think happened was he was grabbed and pulled out the window before the cannon went off. Okay, that's, that's my assessment for now. I don't know how right that is, but that's what I'm going to say for now. Soldiers of the scene, no thank you. You know what I want to see? I want to see this bit again. So we get to be treated to more farts and squishiness. One of the stewards is delivering food. This is Paul Moss. Pretty sure. This is Martin, third mate. As his third mate, Stuart. So we got that right. 56. Can't get a good look at his shoes. Who is 56, actually? Oh, this is Henry. <laughs> this is Brennan. He was asleep when the whole attack started. Here's 45. He was shot by a gun. Although, what's his check? Check. One of the Russians. It's Wei Li. And then there's this guy. Oh. Oh, you just got out of your hammock. But. You just got out of your hammock, but I can't see what number it is. Like 41? Okay. Are you number 41?
41 is Wei Li. Yeah, you're number 41. You go into that hammock. This is your hammock. Which part am I in? Which part of the doom am I in? I need to see this bit, and I can f identify Baldy McBalderson here. Well, yes, Baldur's Gate. There's so much stuff to be figured out from this. We can figure out who these people are, 43 and 44. Maba, we already know that. 44, Lewis Walker, top man. Okay, I need to go one backwards, and then I need to check out who is hanging out in this place. So... This guy died way up top on deck. Oh yeah, there's more stuff to figure out up here. That's the Persian. Yeah, we got him already. It's James Davey. Fourth mate, fourth mate Stewart. Okay. Let's see who's hanging in that hammock with Wei Li. Or not. How's that? No cause for trouble, boys. Get in the boat. Crap. Or I forget. You killed my brother. What? That was an accident. Fell overboard. I wonder if that's one of the midshipmen. I wonder if that's a midshipman. You are not a midshipman. Okay, I got something else I can do here. I need his face again. This guy. I need one of the really early ones. Yeah, in bitter cold. He didn't die in bitter cold. Hmm. Wow. It's a long way to go from there. He didn't die in bitter cold, but what he did do was sleep. He slept up here. Number 44 could not be that easy. Who is number 44? Is that Wei Li? Lewis Walker. Could it really be that easy? No way. Now he was over here, wasn't he? Who was sleeping here? was sleeping there. Can't believe I'm going right back in. We already saw this, but... Shh. 
Shoot! Can't get a good look at his feet either. So, alright, let's try to remember this spot. Uh, one, two compartments, uh, Bowdward, Boward. From the midshipman compartment. Over on this side. This is where his hammock is. With that said... He's in the bitter cold portion, which started Orlop Deck Surgeons towards the aft. Question is, can I climb up a deck? Oh please, oh please. Ah, so close. Ah, this doesn't help. Crap. He's here. He's here somewhere. Got your name. Fifty three is over there. Fifty three got out. Oh, that's him. Oh, my God. Fifty seven. Pretty sure we're looking for a top man, so that's like. Wait a second. Who's got a tattoo of a lady? Number 37 has a tattoo of a lady. This is killing me. This is... This is what going mad feels like. Oh my god. Tattoo of a woman on his right arm. Ah. Uh, I how am I supposed to, how am I supposed to remember that? How am I supposed to have seen some guy with a tattoo on his right arm? How, how am I supposed to know who this guy is? This bald guy. Ah. I'm going insane! I'm... I'm just... What the... My god. My god. I don't suppose it's just as easy as zooming in on his arm. No, I can't see his face, so it won't let me zoom in on his arm. We're just gonna have to remember, aren't we? I... I need... I need paper. I need pen. Number 37. Tattoo of woman on right arm. Am I going to have to start taking notes? Is that what this is turning into? Okay. Okay. We have the two Russians here. That we're not sure which one is which.
But you know what? We know the Russian. Let's call them Russian. This is arbitrary, but I am tired of looking at them. Look, look at this. They're, they're even... They don't even have tags on their hammocks. Oh, yes, they do. 45 and 46. Ugh. 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 I'm... Oh, God. Tattoo on right arm. Tattoo on right arm. Who would even look like he's got a tattoo on his right arm? But you know where the top men hang out. On the top. see a tattoo on his arm. He's one of the contenders, right? We know he's a top man, but we don't have a name for him. That guy... Guy kind of looks Chinese. I can hear my wife in the other room. Good lord. There's the cook. Cookie. What about this guy? What do we know about this guy? Bookmark his memories. I have a theory. He's one of the guys. Also, while I'm here, in uh, Soldiers from the Sea. Is he up here with us? No, he is not. I'm trusting my gut on this. I'm just not 100% sure I should. I'm also, I realize I'm not like doing any kind of uh, systematic search. I, I know I probably should be keeping track of this more carefully. Oh, it's Orlop deck. Oh, it's just over here. Okay. Mm. Let's see if we can find that our dancing gentleman. Get true discolored stone of bread. I'll cut a trough when you've done it. Yeah. I think that's Come one on of the, the midshipmen. In fact, you know what? Let's 
For now, it's... He looks like a midshipman. Temporary. That guy is a midshipman. See what else we can find around here. I hear you. No tattoo. Oh, we actually have you identified. There's the kind of China man. Don't see Baldy. I don't see tattoo guy or dancer, whatever we want to call him. Huh? Did I just call him Charlie? Never been on a farm, Charlie. This is Charlie. Hi, Charlie. Is Charlie a midshipman? Charlie is a midshipman. <laughs> that helps quite a bit. What about this chicken? What's your name, chicken? Huh. Let's see the dancer guy. Oh, this is passenger's quarters. Okay, that makes sense. Can I climb up? No. So we are distinctly missing this, this guy who should be in this area. But where is he? What? What are he? Is he next door? Is he? Is he hide? Whoa! Hi. Why are you here? Let me see your arm. What room is this? Surgery. You're not the surgeon. But you're in the surgeon's quarters. I dub the surgeon's mate. James Wallace. Strangled by a terrible beast. Gotcha. That was weird. Still, I'm pretty sure that's accurate. And uh, we can play switcheroo with the midshipmen while we're here. Because there are only like three midshipmen. Thomas and Peter. Do you look like a Thomas or a Peter? Hmm. Here, yeah, come on. There, sir, mind your shoes now. I'm going to call you Thomas. And I'm going to call you Peter. No, you're Thomas. I realize I'm playing a meta game here. And you're Peter. Boom! Got you, Paul Moss. Okay, Charlie was easy. Okay. So one of the things we can definitely infer from this, I think, is this guy right here. He is still Thomas. He's still a midshipman. That's not the problem. The problem is who he was killed by. 
because it means that this guy is still wrong. This guy's driving me fucking up the wall. He's not the gunner's mate. He can't be the purser. Pursers wouldn't dress like that. I, maybe he's the ship steward, but the problem is, is that he's not in a steward's outfit. This is what a steward looks like. He's not a ship mitten. God, that's all that's left. All that's left is the gunner's mate the, and the purser and the ship's steward. But that leaves... That, there are problems. Because we got all the stewards named except these two. And it comes down to that whole thing again where I had mentioned, does he look Irish or Indian? He looks slightly Indian to me. And he looks semi-Irish to me. I, that just leaves this guy as being a purser, but that doesn't make any sense. Let's try something. Let's call this guy the purser. Which is stupid. But let's say he was knifed by the purser. I don't see the world crashing before us. So either these two are switched around, or I got the purser wrong. Okay. Unknown Stuart. Unknown Stuart. What we've learned is that we cannot play this game. Not with these guys. And we're... He just doesn't look like a purser. Good lord. Which means that this guy was not knifed by the purser. Where is the purser located? How can we identify the purser or lop deck? We're in the cargo hold now, right? No, we're in the or lop deck. Purser's on this side. At some point, was this door ever open? There must have been. There was so much crazy on the Orlop deck. Right? Let's look for a corpse that's near the purser's office. Like, I don't know, how about when a giant monster attacked? That guy's spiked. So here's the purser's office. I don't see anybody coming out to see what the hell's going on.
You're the surgeon, aren't you? Yeah, you are. You're the butcher. You got butchered. You're one of the midshipmen. Who's this on top? You're the other midshipmen. Spiked. You got more spiked than my punch. Okay, these guys are coming downstairs, so... Knowing that. Here's another midshipman. Later on, he was knifed. He survived to die. Don't, don't we all do that? Here's the bosun, which makes me think that this is the bosun's mate. Blasted with a cannon. By a foreign enemy. By a terrible beast, which is ridiculous. I don't suppose there's an option for accident. I'm pretty sure we got this guy right, but for some reason it's not allowing it to set. What did I just do? Why did I do that? Oh well, it doesn't matter. We're trying to figure out if maybe the person's gonna come out of his office. Where am I? Purser is behind me. Oh, that doesn't give me much to play with. Fourth mate, the Persian. Not seeing much here. Okay, that's Winston. That's Nathan. Okay, I'm starting to see why it's getting harder the fewer people that we have left. Because with the lack of clues, you're Chinese. How could I tell which of the Chinese men you are? Huang Li, Zhi Zheng, Li Hong. This whole thing is trouble. So now... What's going on? Stay back! It's a way to the Hey! Come on, boss! No! Get there! Hey! Cats! So, the reason why, that's a nice looking steed you got there, look at that in my Maple Story 2 run there, so, okay, let's get out of here, collect our thoughts, as it were, because I'm starting to go nowhere. We're well over halfway done. But, unlike before, I can't just walk around willy-nilly like I have been doing. Reason being is because... Ah! The, uh... I can't stumble on a guy anymore and say, oh, I know this guy, he's such and such. 
and say, haha, I figured it out. Instead, what I gotta do is start looking at people like this man, the surgeon's mate, which we're pretty sure is correct. I gotta start looking at people and identifying them one at a time. Like this guy. He fell overboard. He's in 11 memories. And now I have to track down this guy specifically. And just be dogged about it. Not trip over and be distracted like I have been. So, okay. We know he fell over. Uh, fell overboard during the Doom. He was one of the people that loaded into the ship. Which is how we know it was him. And then we saw him later on. And in fact, disappeared in the Doom. Like many others, like this guy, he also fell to his death. This guy's got two triangles. Maybe we'll work on him. Now, now this is what I'm talking about. Now, let's work on this guy specifically. So what can we tell about him? His outfit doesn't strike me as a top man or a seaman. He's more African based. Or American. How many people from Africa or America are here? Sierra Leone, wasn't that an African thing? We'll keep that in mind. England, China, 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 Scotland, Ireland, India. He doesn't strike me as an India guy. Scotland, Poland, Austria. Gotta keep an eye out for that Austrian. You know what? He might be the guy from Sierra Leone. Might be that easy. Who was the other guy who, who died when he died? This midshipman, or officer, was he a midshipman? Also fell over. What memories was he in? This is when he was loading onto a ship. I think. Need something earlier to play with. Yeah. Like this one, or what was his first time? When was he introduced? Unholy captives. That was on the Orlop. I want to say I may have found the purser. But I'm probably wrong. So where is this guy? Let's get another look at him. There he is. This officer fell overboard. This is the first time he shows up. Let's find him. Well, that was fucking easy. Oh, this is the purser. Look at this guy. He is way well dressed. Look how nice his coat is. I'm I'm totally got, Okay, I'm calling it now for now. I'm pretty sure this guy's the purser. Comes out to see what's going on. Bullshit happens. What else is he in? He's also Soldiers of the Sea. 
which we were just at. Let's find him. But that dress, come on, that's the purser. Man, I feel so glad I have this map. That is so useful. I don't think so. down this hallway because that's where this guy crawls to die. Nope. Not him. That's the butcher. Where is this guy? Is he upstairs? No. Now this guy. Oh, that's what happened to him. Surgeon's mate. Wait a second. There's that mystery man. Where is he? Like... It says he's on here, but what was he doing? Where is he hiding? Is he in one of the bunks? He said to hide in the cow pen? He's not the two bodies on the floor right there. Is he hiding in here? Are you, my friend? I'm facing the purser's office. Well, well, well. Called it. So, who's next? The two Stuarts can be trouble. I'm sick of looking at him, honestly. This guy, uh. Although, now we know he isn't. God. I want to call him the gunner. You know, I really want to call him the gunner. This mysterious gentleman. An unknown soul met an unknown fate. He disappeared during the doom. Let's track him down. So let's start... 
Aha. Let's start by finding out the last memory he was in. Really? Might be easy finding his body then. Abigail. Gotta talk to Abigail again. It's been a while. And heck, well, maybe we'll learn something new. We're older and wiser. Whoop. I don't know why I thought that was the entrance. Okay. We're looking for the mysterious guy. Could be anywhere. Is that him? Nope. Oh, that's Wei Li. Torn apart by the beast. That's the bosun. There he is. This is the last thing we know about him? What the? I have no clue what happened to him. I... How am I supposed to know what happened to him? What, did he fall overboard? What happened after the doom? The bargain. We don't know what happened after the bargain. The escape thing happened. We can only infer there's no body. If we haven't been all over the ship, we haven't found this guy's body. Not even a memory of his body. So he is not on board the ship. I don't see any easy way off here. That kind of leaves his options limited. I'm going with drown for now. But it could easily be crushed by the beast. Is there anything else that... Best I can do. Drowned by an unknown attacker? Okay, maybe that's the wrong one. Is there a lost at sea? Crushed by the beast? Eaten? Oh, this is actually cannibalized was the option there. Fell overboard. That's what I'm saying about this guy. And I, uh... Okay, we can't just move on. We gotta stick with him. So. Curious. Is he one of the guys... Yeah. No, he was in the cargo. This is the first time we see him. Was he there during the bitter cold? Does he have a tattoo of a woman on his right arm? Okay, let's go back in time and see this guy. Let's go, like, where are we? The Doom is where we last saw him. Where was he before this? Because he's all over the Doom. The next one is this guy. Oh, yeah, right here. Alrighty. 
And... Yep, there's our man. I don't see a tattoo on his arm. We know he can handle a spear. Took this spear, stabbed that guy, went over here, stabbed another tentacle. Nothing saying who he is. Really? It goes that far back? I thought he was... No, I guess not. Okay, well... Next one is Soldier of the Sea. Starting here. On the cargo deck. Let's see what else we can find with this guy. I suspect this is what this is going to end up turning into, is me slowly tracking a man down, getting to know him, getting to know all about him. Getting to know him, getting to know he knows me. It's in the front area of the cargo. Yep. I am on the opposite side. I kind of got a feeling this is the guy with the tattoo. But I don't know that for sure. I mean, we got him right. Oh, hi. Oh, you're, you're Mamba. Hi, Mamba. You're what's-his-face. Um. Where, where's the man? Is that him? I can discern no information from this, except that, once again, he's good with a spear. Okay, this didn't help. It was in part eight. Okay, well. There's the door out of here. deck and that's right you got to go around the purser's office which means I won't get a good look at this guy but maybe I'll get lucky and catch his arm this was an exciting episode not this episode but the one where this guy like I found this guy and we were finding Giant bug monsters written, ridden by evil mermaids, I think. <laughs> More stuff pointing out that this guy may be the, uh... Whoa! Whoa. Um... Oh, that was exciting. This is the gunner's store. Alright, I'm calling it. This is the gunner. We've called him a gunner before, and for some reason it didn't stick, but now this is the gunner. And if that's the gunner, then the mate that was stabbed... that was knifed, was knifed by the gunner. That's our best guess for now. Meanwhile, where is our friend? 
Yeah, see the Persian over there. I think that's our friend, but I can't get a good enough look at him to get any kind of info from him. Bosun. Bosun again. Not getting a lot of info from all this. That's a surgeon. Hiding. Can't quite see who that guy is. Oh, hi. Ah, there's a purser. How did you die? Fell overboard. Wonder why you haven't gone in yet. Okay. Next up was part five when this guy was spiked. Okay. More walking. Would you call this a walking simulator? I guess not, because it is a proper game game. Like, th there are rules, and there is a fail state. You know? Oh. Um. Oh. Okay. I mean, we could get it wrong and just spend an eternity... <laughs> There's a man. Uh, once again, no tattoo. You can handle a gun all right. I'm gonna call him one of the seamen. He is not a top man. Look at what he's wearing. Now, this guy's a seaman. What options does that give us, actually? Like, who are the seamen that are left over? Russian, Russian, English, Irish, and uh, English. I got nothing. <laughs> Still, it, it narrows it down to three possibilities. And I'm hoping he's not a guy that I require uh, process of elimination. What else? The one right before this. Oh, this guy. Does he have a gun at this time? That's Charlie. That's the cook. Yeah, that's the cook. We got him. That's that one guy that was constantly crawling away. So none of this. Bosun's mate. Handed our man a rifle. The gunner is pushing open the gate. I wonder why I got him wrong. Or what I got about him that was wrong. Okay. What's the next memory? Because I don't think that really helps. I'll we'll take another look at him. Um... Huh. Okay, let's take another look at him real quick. Everything's dark, can't see anything. If he's got a tattoo, I can't see it. So that's a no. There's our way out. Next one is topside, on deck.
forward and to the right. This guy? Yep, this guy. Or two guys. Okay, that guy has speared. Where's our man? There's our man. No, that's Nathan. Never mind. Whoa. Have we done you? Oh, you're baldy. Pretty good look at this guy's arm. I'm not seeing him. Huh. Brennan? This guy who we kind of guessed who he was? Oh, we already know you. You're Nathan. You're Lars. Been done with you for a while. Speared by a beast. Oh. Oh, that guy was electrocuted. So, what's the next memory? If he's in this one, either we've seen him or he was too small to actually notice. What's the next one? Unholy Captive. How do I get there? cargo deck. Oh yeah, the sawing off the, the limb. Okay, I'm gonna let this episode run a little bit long because I feel like we're close, man. But if we can't figure out who this guy is by the next uh, bit in, what was it? The cargo? Then I'm gonna call it good either way. All right, let's see if we can find our man. Keep pressure here. Okay, I got nothing on this guy, so I'm going to call it an episode. That's disappointing, and I guess they can't all be good, but I mean, there was some, in the last two episodes, there was some uh, progress. We're getting closer, man. We're getting closer. So, okay. With that said, let me go ahead and end it. So that's it for the Mystery Hour Double Attack Edition. And thank you to anybody who might be lurking in the background. Thank you to everybody on YouTube for spending a little bit of your day with me and trying to figure out this weird thing. I would say leave a comment below telling me what I'm getting wrong, but A, spoilers, and B, I'm probably going to have an episode figuring this out, like, long before this is posted. Back for the five minutes. Doom Lad, you, you caught us just in time to, for us to go away. Anyway, um, have a great day, everybody. Yeah, that's right.